Hello there and welcome back. In this video we are going to take a look at how you can create a CLI with the help of uh, the Hug web framework. So let's say we import the Hug module and uh, we would like to create a CLI for which we pass an argument and returns the nth Fibonacci number. So first we need a function which is called Fibonacci and uh, we pass the number that we would like to get from the sequence and if the number is in 0 and 1 we return the number as we return the Fibonacci and number minus 1 plus Fibonacci number minus 2. So let's go ahead and print the Fibonacci 10 just uh, to verify. So Python hello CLI and the 10th Fibonacci number is 55. All right now we can create our CLI. So at hug CLI. We would like to use the hug get and we would like to use the hug local as decorators and uh, let's call this function fibo and we would like to use the n which is going to be coming the types number and uh, what we would like to do is to return the message or rather the uh, the n th Fibonacci number is uh, we would like to get the Fibonacci n uh, and what we would like to do is to do the time elapsed float and we would like to pass the hug timer equals 3 hug timer. So now if everything goes well what we can do is to create our if name equals main and use the fibo that interface that CLI and how do we execute this? So what we need to do is to use the hug dash f hello CLI dot py dash c fibo and ten. And now as you can see it took like literally no time to calculate the tenth Fibonacci number it took a little bit more time to calculate the 20th Fibonacci number and we need to make this F string. So the 20th Fibonacci number is 6765 and the time elapsed was this amount of time. So let's make this the 30th. It took a little bit more time. So that way uh, you can uh, basically create your CLI interface with the help of HUG. And that was all I wanted to show you in this video. See you in the next one.